And then the last one I have here, knives and throwing stars and swords and shit. Dude, flies are stupid idiots. I can't even tell you how many flies I've caught in my life, where it's just like, they're just there and I just, I literally have a picture. I have a picture of me catching a fly. That's how fucking- By its wings? Look at this picture. What are you, Bruce Lee? Uh, I didn't use chopsticks, but I definitely caught a fly with my finger. Race a horse, I just wanna like have it, maybe ride it around my property. Oh, you're gonna learn how to ride the horse. Learn, I just, just get on that bitch. No, no, you need yeah, to no, learn. you hire a guy who like feeds him and he knows some stuff and he's like, get on there. Giraffes give birth mm -hmm. to giraffes. Yeah. Like a giraffe will fall out of a giraffe. Yes. And it's already like a full giraffe. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Yes. Like not a bait, not like anything that needs to grow. It falls I mean, they, out. They do need to grow a little bit. Yeah, but they fall out. Boom, a giraffe. Oh, also, not only that, they're falling 10 feet to the floor. Yeah, that's the problem. Baby, brand new. Imagine giving birth on top of a small building, like off the off your balcony, and then your baby hits the concrete. That's what happens with giraffes. I mean, they're built for fucking height. Yeah, they got stilts on. But then as soon as they're born, right, they're fucking, they're, they, they hit the floor, they get up, and then a, they're running from fucking cheetahs. They're, they're born giraffes. How do they know that out of the womb? Because in their mind, they've been doing this for millions of years where they're like... But how does it know that? It's been inside of a giraffe. It's built into our DNA that it's like, yo, get up, get, get out, get up, go. Yeah, but like... When we're born, there's things like we can sneeze and shit and yeah. breathe or whatever oh, yeah. the fuck. But everyone can do that. But if, you, but if I was born... And then a fucking something was chasing me? What? I'm just laying there. This is the thing. This is the thing. I actually read a book about this when I was in college. It's called The Gift of Fear, where it's like we're born with instincts, millions of years of instincts. And it's like maybe sometimes follow those instincts. Those animals are born to be afraid of things, and most of the time it helps them stay alive. Come up with a better name. What do you mean? Human trafficking. I hear that, and I just think of like... Like a crowded, driving in Manhattan. Yeah, like a crowded club. Like make it sound scarier. It's like human traffic. I'm like a woman named Barbara would like fake make a fossil. Like I'm talking about I want a real dinosaur leg. Um, I'll tell you right now. Can I buy a dinosaur leg? I'll tell you right now. Or an egg. You could also buy like I think animals. You might be able to buy animals on there. <laughs> nah, like whatever. So like whatever like southern white women put in their I kitchens. We're playing and we're playing games. I'm a bad guy. What the fuck are you talking about? Are you um, flirting with me now? Uh, maybe. You trying to have zags? Well, you know. My <laughs> jaw doesn't really move me. <laughs> and getting this off my head is a lot of pain for it's, me. Oh, well, that, I guess, you know. Because I think it's made for children, but you know. <laughs> One second. That's not supposed to happen. <laughs> where, like, how, oh, like, where and how? Ow! Oh my god. I am getting his malfunctioning. He's a goat. You're Pro dead. Okay, this is how you know it's bullshit. It's fucking bullshit. Uh, let me. I'm gonna take a wild guess. Personality. There's three things. All right, I'm gonna take a wild guess. Calm. Is it really? <laughs> really? Go. <laughs> Calm. Level-headed. No. Calm. Loving. <laughs> no. <laughs> Obedient. Calm is legitimately the first thing. <laughs> That scared me. I would, I would, of, of all the things I would classify your dad. We calm. joke, we joke around. Your dad's a good guy. Yeah. Not, not calm. calm. Not calm. <laughs> also, the next word, gentle. Definitely not gentle. No, he's not. Definitely not he's gentle. He's not. We're talking about a man that I would sit next to at dinner and he used to stab me with his fork all the time. Yeah, but that was because you were a little asshole. I would even, even Still in. Still stab. Uh, and the last word is sympathetic. <laughs> Not think of three opposite, more opposite words. Did I tell you the story about how my dad hit a raccoon? No, I hate raccoons. Let them all die. Every single one. Oh, time out. I'll raccoons them, are mad cute. Gut, I'll gut them all and fucking string them up. I hate them all. Them and possums. Well, possums are gross. Because they so have are mean, raccoons a little yeah, fucking. No, possums have mean faces, but raccoons are cute. Bucket is supposed to tip. Yes. But I just made it so the bucket would fall. So the so, bucket just <laughs> hit my mom. <laughs> filled with water. So a bang. A pail. A filled, pail filled with water. Yes, struck your mom on the fucking crown of her skull, and she. Guess what? The water, by the way, went all over the hallway. <laughs> Not on her. No. Okay. <laughs> so, because the bucket hit her head, the water just spilled out. Yeah. She turned around, pow! And I was like, I deserve that. That one. That one. Made I miss you too, Frank. I passed. I mean, climbing Mount Everest. I have negative. I almost don't respect people who do it. Joey.
Joey, you it's, run for three miles. Get the sun on you. In my head, three miles, that's two and a half hours, okay? Have you ever, did you ever sell anything? Did you ever have a job where you like sold stuff? Yeah, myself during an interview. You ever done one of those, you stupid idiot? No, you sell yourself every day, don't you? You, um, uh, you know my parents separated? Yeah. Divorced. I know that they don't love each other. Yes, yes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I used Instacart the other day. Me, we do it. Bro, I used it for the first time. And like, I like knew it existed, never I guess. Go, never going back. Dude, that was a borderline sexual experience. Yeah, it was. It was fairly orgasmic. I was orgasmic. sitting in my bed, and I put thirty-five items. And then you just went. You have a front pouch where you can put your phone, where you can put a water bottle, where you could put other stuff. Yeah, not a child. I, well, I can't no. have a blind guy on here. Honestly, <laughs> I just can't. No, that'd be, not that it's wrong. I'm already Hispanic and poor. You can't have me being another. <laughs> <laughs> Another classification is, uh, you know. <laughs> yeah, I can't have this. Yeah. I almost blew up this whole apartment. Wait, what? Yeah. Like, uh, the whole thing was almost gone? Yeah. What would we have done for the basement yard? Forget the basement yard, bro. I would have been homeless. Oh, well, <laughs> no, you wouldn't have been homeless. You have, like, five houses in the store, yeah. I don't. Yeah, well. I opened it up too early because, if it, like, immediately when the fire goes out, if you open it, it can still catch fire again. Oxygen. Right. Which happened. Okay. So I open it and I go, yo, and then <laughs> smoke billows out of this thing. Black. And then, yeah. And then fucking, poof, I was like, okay. And I shut <laughs> it again. Breaker box and I threw the breaker for the microwave because I didn't want it to be on. It was still on. The so microwave to, was on? Like, like dude, heating up the smoke? During the fire. The microwave is cooking the fire. <laughs> cooking, yeah. And I don't know what That's happens when you, when you microwave a fire. Actually, now I do. You ever go to like the dentist or something and they put that fucking bulletproof vest on you to take an x-ray bro like, yo what is this you ever see cool? what they have to put kids in what and they put them in and they're stuck in this fucking tube and that's how they do x-rays hold the, what look it up what do i type in baby radiation baby no don't do that baby x-ray machine it's like yo we're just gonna take some inside pictures of how you. is that real i don't know bro but i yo <laughs> literally go type in baby x-ray machine to google right now Hit the button that says images, and then look at all these babies about to be blended. Yeah, it's basically... It's just blendered babies. Men can't do anything. Especially white men and straight white men. <laughs> Go ahead. They are marginalized. And under attack, aren't they? Uh, they are under attack. Yeah? They're just, like, insane. It's, they're talking about, like, what women have to offer, and he's like, this woman comes in with a used vagina. <laughs> That's what he said! A used... used vagina? Are they all used to some degree? Oh, not if they're a fucking uh, 30-year-old virgin. I mean, sure, but even then, they're pi pissing out of that son of a bitch.